Water is everything, but its future faces many challenges. Ensuring everyone and every living thing have access to good quality water is still a challenge. Sometimes animals and plants can lose out as we take more water for use in our homes, our fields and our factories. And there's too many pollutants from human waste, farm waste to plastics end up in rivers like this one. This river provides drinking water for thousands of people and countless wildlife. But it's also a place of sanctuary, of play, of relaxation and there's growing scientific evidence of just how important our waterways are for human health and well-being. Even in beautiful places like this, with the strongest levels of protection, nature can struggle to thrive, and that's why we at Natural England are working with others to enable nature's recovery. The hero of this water story is nature itself. When our ponds, rivers and wetlands are left to work as nature intended, they can do some amazing things. They can take carbon out of our atmosphere, they can hold back floods, they can uh, clean up drinking water. And there are some really good examples of where water companies are working with nature, with land managers and with local communities in order to harness that power. We need to scale up, we need to mainstream this so that the water sector with other sectors like farming can play its part in mitigating damaging climate change, protecting us from flood and drought and delivering the ambitions of the government's 25 year environment plan. The rules and laws that protect watery places like this are hugely important and we must get these right as we transition out of the EU. But the whole system needs to deliver more for people and wildlife, driving investment in natural capital in order to reduce the environmental harms and deliver biodiversity net gain. Everyone should be able to afford water and enjoy the well-being benefits that wonderful places like this provide without placing undue burdens on wildlife and ensuring that we value every last drop. The public care deeply about this. The national statistics show that 86% are concerned about damage to the environment. So we need to connect these concerns with the places that people love and the water that's coming out of their taps. Together we need to tell a much fuller and more vibrant water story. Our vision for the water sector is one with nature's recovery at its heart, not only because it's the right thing to do, but because the public demand it and the future of the water sector depends upon it. And together we can get there.